You think you're going to be classified as a cat video? What? Oh, I have to. So we'll watch this later. Two video to watch up on. You you did something on some episode further back that you did something and you just told me I had to watch it. Oh, pardon. Uh, which video was that again? Here. Biological artifact? Wait, hold on. I'm not used to artifact being used in that uh, sentence. One of those grumpy meme faces. I say it is comical if that is him. <laughs> yeah, so one with a triangle head and glasses, but no bow tie. Does that one rope have it, maybe? Yeah. 
Yeah, the, the, this game is interesting, but I noticed some annoying things like... Yeah, some NPCs seem to never turn. And I hope that it's programmed so that the one you also put to target always is moving or doing something that you think and never are part of those that never turn around. For that, nothing. yeah, for us, it's just a big middle finger to you. Okay, I can hear you just fine. Okay, I have no idea what happened, but it seems that Discord, or no, that OBS just stopped recognizing my mic. Okay. Yeah, that, yeah, so everything I just said for the last seven minutes or so has been wasted. Uh, okay, I, I, I have no idea what happened there. Uh, is it working now? Yeah, it's recording now, but I'll probably have to figure around with these values again after this. But, oh well. Um, basically, what I was saying, uh, today things will be a bit different. We're going to be finishing up with this game, which we played on a something Sunday before, I think. Uh, it should be yep. short enough to finish it. Then we'll. I have a second game prepped for this. And, uh, yeah... Uh, that, that earlier, that tail going back and forth, that was my you know, one of our cats, uh, Ink. Uh, typically, she only really gets on the desk and rubs against anything to get attention to get her food bowl filled, or uh, rather the food bowls of her, hers and Oscar's, not that they actually only eat out of one of them. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, I'd filled the food earlier, so it can't have been because of that. So I don't know what the heck else she wanted. Yeah, re really strange that OBS just disconnected my mic. I have, I have no idea why it did that. Uh, either way, we're looking for Bill Nye the Triangle Guy. Yeah, I sort of wonder if that first thing we saw over there is him. And now my <clears throat> now my mouse pointer is showing up in the game because of that uh, having to Alt Tab. I still, uh, I, don't, I still think it's either one of these two. Yeah, though, if, if, that, if it is that one on the roof, that's bad design. Right. This one seems to match, but the bow tie doesn't seem to have spots on it like in the preview. Yeah. Well, it is a bow tie. Probably is from what they saw on the bow tie, the damn magazine is hiding just enough us to be able to see if it's spotted or not. We have... So it may be him. So, so yeah, it's 50-50 on him, actually. It is also supposed to be an, an artifact or something. Uh, or probably a bag that it holds the... Uh, that holds the bomb or something. Uh, why is mission failed? Tox okay. It wasn't even up to the time limit. Uh, let's see. Thank you for notifying of that, uh, Atlas Gaming. Uh, and I just returned from a nap and haven't responded to roleplay for a while now, <laughs> Lemo. The sniping sequence reminds me of the old uh, Sift Heads games. <laughs> Childhood. Okay, can't say I know of that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's spots on the bow tie. Hmm. I would call it spots, more like a pattern. Uh, yeah, what sort of roleplay do we do then, Atlas? Uh, 
Okay, it was it wasn't that one. Uh, Drakir and I have role played in Guild Wars 2 for a while, and besides that, I've done a bit, uh, well, a lot in Star Trek Online. Uh, did I say yeah. Guild Wars 2 Online or something? <laughs> Yeah, we started in Guild Wars 2, but we have also done some Discord roleplay, but mostly main roleplay has been on uh, Guild Wars. Yeah. Well, now I guess it will be in, uh, a bit 50 50. Let's see. Unfortunately, you can't play those anymore since they need Flash, and that's been taken out. Actually, I hear there, there's a. Um, there's a site, Flashpoint something, or if you if you look up Flashpoint Project, you'll find it. It's basically a collection of like nearly every Flash game that was on the net. Bloody heck. And I think, I, yeah, I think even some Flash gamers are remaking their Flash games to be on Steam and such. A good example would be, well, of course, Henry Stickman Collection. Now, I've never played those myself, but I have seen Captain Sauce play through them entirely, I think, and I saw... <laughs> oh, just missed. That seems to be a triangle with glasses. Yeah, I've seen Captain Sauce, Multiplier... I think even Jack Semtik and a few other YouTubers play it. Uh, both the Flash versions and the newer versions. Uh, versions. I can't speak today. Oh, that's that was him. Oh. There Wait, we go. Yeah. Wait, we got points. It seemed unlocked the doubts. Let's see. Some people might say that we are heroes, after all, we risk our lives and do normal things people would never do. Your normal people would never do. What they don't realize is that we not always know the real reason behind the missions. Well, the orders are orders. Like my squad mate John said, who kills our targets are the orders. I keep on trying to convince myself of it. Yeah, but what if the orders getting coming through are, yeah, based on something other than you to support yourself? Is this like a night, a, a, a theater, a movie theater? And this this is going towards them having assassinated someone um, that they regret. Let's see, Anthony, philanthropist billionaire. Yep. Dangerousness I'm zero. Uh, you were going to say something? I was asked. I never understood what philanthropy pissed means. Um, I think it basically translates to do-gooder. Like, uh, Tony Stark is considered a philanthropist, I think, because he's in the Marvel comics and you know, in the Marvel universe, he spends a lot of time, a lot of time and money on uh, helping people, not just as Iron Man, but also just by. Uh, providing scholarships and such. Okay, so the um, philanthropist billionaire is a very good thing then. Yeah. Uh, Basically, he tries to do something good for people with his wealth. And so I'm just typing out something in chat to. Uh, yeah, if you Google that, you should be able to find, uh, or you should be able to find the project which might have those games you're talking about. Anyways, through an anonymous tip, we were informed that Mr. Anthony, a philanthropist yeah, that loves ballooning, became the target of someone that does not enjoy his donations to humanitarian causes. Yeah, basically that, do donating a lot to yeah, humanitarian causes. Okay, this is another sniper elimination. Oh, that's right. We have so a very short window. Basically, this is who we're gonna protect them. Yeah. I was wondering why are we to assassinate him? Then I started to realize, oh, we have to protect him. Okay. Last time we saw someone's P 
peeking out of a window with a gun. I'm guessing we have to find the similar among the crowd here. Let's see. Oh, there are so many places to hide. Uh, oh. uh, what the? I get the feeling it. Yeah, we've got other balloons incoming, <laughs> including alien balloons. Including um, the compass, their own logo. Uh, yeah. Shark balloon? Coin balloon? Is it anyone on these balloons? Because, yeah. Shooting someone from the ground would be difficult, but shooting someone from a moving target to another uh, moving target would also be a very difficult shot. So, all we can really do right now is to wait for someone with a gun to show up and... Hmm. That depends. Wouldn't it be easier to just shoot the balloon? Yeah, that, that could also be what they'd go for. Then again, just a small hole in a big balloon like that wouldn't really do much. Uh, it would re need a really big uh, hole for it to go crashing. It, that's a pig. Mm, true. Oh, hello. Oh, this is a pig. <laughs> okay. So well it done. was a moving target to a moving target. Forgive me, Katie, I wasn't able to protect you. We shouldn't have gotten this close. We knew it was dangerous, but being honest, I never felt so good in a life like what I was by your side. The training was clear about the risks, but we couldn't help it. I'm really sorry. Yeah, if, if, when you get close to someone, it also means you run the risk of losing them, of course. Hmm. Paperback gang. Open safe boxed. Okay, I'm guessing that means safe cracking or something. Wanted for multiple bank robberies, three stars. We were informed by of a possible assault on the central bank by the by the the paper and bag gang, which is linked to weapons trafficking. Four minutes time. Watch over the bank and eliminate the robbers. Don't let anyone escape. Okay. So, anyone with a paper bag on their head, or any square with a paper bag on their head, is dead. <laughs> hey, I, I get the feeling they'll... Uh, I get the feeling they'll be coming up in a car like this. I <laughs> was hoping it's going to open fire on these. So this is ba basically another defense mission, but our targets will be coming towards our sights instead. Hmm. Yeah, they said don't let them escape. Yeah, they'll be Way. heading for the bank anyways. So from there, they'll probably start running the moment we open fire. So I have to ask. Having a I'm sniper a for an anti-bank robbery job seems a bit odd. Like, snipers yeah, are yeah. part of uh, special forces, but usually you yeah. send in, like, actual ground cops as well. Yeah, and it, they did say they were linked to weapon trafficking, but still, yeah. But in the way they wrote it, it makes me wonder, are they already inside the explosion? Yeah, they... Yeah, we missed a shot. Okay, so they're already inside. Bloody heck, that sound made me look behind myself towards the window. <laughs> I'm going to be unsure. Is that the game or is that a, a car alarm again? <laughs> okay, so it's just a waiting game. So they're already inside of them, as I was mm. suspecting for. Why otherwise write it, don't let them escape. Sense here. Why, right? Don't let them escape if you're supposed to prevent them from entering. It means basically they're already inside. Let's see. Two visible exits, a lot of big windows, which is probably a good design for a bank since if there is an armed robbery, there is not really much area you can hide. With, well, with big windows like that, 
uh, police that would be seized the place would have, have like bait. What I'm trying to say is, there will be little place to not be able to be shot from inside. I'm having real difficulty talking today, apparently. <laughs> But yeah, it's just a waiting game until they strike and try to run. Yeah, and we all have those days where it's hard to talk. Okay, keeping my hand on the mouse. I'm guessing on the hour it'll strike. Nope, or not. That's one. That's two. And, oh, come. Wanted to talk. Huh? Eh? I was lining up for the third one. Okay. Do I, ha do I have to wait for them to just get out so they can't take cover or something? Uh, I'm guessing this guy is the getaway driver then? Wait. Okay, I'm keeping my eye on this guy. We know now when it sets off, like uh, 59.30. If this guy puts on a paper bag, I'm... Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm just doming him. Because, yeah, we, we shot two of them here. The number three was heading for the back. So, yep. I didn't see a fourth. So, I'm guessing that is this guy. Like... A circle in a paper bag would look square in this. But why is screaming at you? Uh, okay, this, I should... this is so fishy. Ah. Ah. Oh, come on. <laughs> I clipped the bag. Okay, third time's the charm, or fourth. Okay, this one we are struggling with a little bit. And yeah, what he did put on a bag. Yep, and we know this is him this time. Yeah, but if we shoot too early, we'll probably get like, uh, that was not your target or something. Hmm. Also, it looks a bit odd that the wheels on the cars are not angled. Yeah. And you almost look at the back end of the car's wheel looks almost bigger or something? Or, or am I just my eyes being tricked here? Mm. Yeah, I think my eyes have been tricked. Yeah, yeah it, 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 the line is shorter, but it is a little bit further away, so... It would look smaller still, or, which could mean that they technically they would be the same length, but yeah, that, that's just geometric, uh, the semantics at the moment. 20 seconds. But yeah, I should have expected that the car parked right in front of the uh, bank would be the getaway car. Yeah, I was going to do this well. Okay, number four. There we go. Achieve not locked heroes. Still don't understand what went wrong in that mission. It was quite simple. We had to locate the terrorist and prevent him from obtaining classified information. We did our homework and everything was perfect. But everything went so wrong. Damn it, why? Okay, so a mission gone wrong then. Also something I noticed in the background is... Uh, yeah, a lot of beer cans all over the place. Beer cans, Chinese food, pizza... 
Okay, Agent Y, Secret Agent, no dangerous, so probably another shield. Flower hat, pearl necklace, and sunglasses. <laughs> okay, those totally don't really fit together. The identity of our infiltrated agent in a terror cell was discovered. Apparently they will poison her, but stay put, they might have a plan B. Hit the glass of poisoned wine before the agent drinks it and eliminate the poisoner. Three shots. Okay. So we have to find her. A hexagon, flower hat, sunglasses, neutral and ne neutral mouth and pearls. Flower, hexagon, pearls. Yes, she's going to drink it. But she's probably on a terrace is the right word, I think. Oh, no, no sunglasses. Hmm. Let's see. The hat is probably going to be one of the biggest identifiers at the moment. Let's see. Hexagon, hat. Pearls. You no know, sunglasses, I know there's a triangle. Also out of our reach. Hmm. Could she you know that no hat? Nope, no sunglasses. Okay. This is as low as we can aim, so let's slowly work our way up. Oh, hello, there she is. Okay, so someone is going to walk up and try and poison her. I'm guessing it's this guy. Oh, it's a food place to walk around with. Yeah, I thought it was a walk around oh, with a knife. I, yeah, that one seems to be moving very deliberately. Yeah, and the only one that has a gloves on his food tray. Okay. That miss. You have missed. I had a freak. I had a spare. Oh, they have a plan B, of course. That's why we have three bullets. But now we know where she'll go. So we can wait for the herd there. Hmm. Okay, then while we wait, anything to talk about? Um... Yeah, for tomorrow I have some games prepped up already. We'll still need to test them. Um, pardon? After dinner, as always. Uh, technically, <laughs> it would probably be better to stream before dinner. Because then you don't have a stomach that's being busy with stuff. And then again, you could also end up playing uh, <laughs> gaming when you're hungry. Yeah, that that's kind of, uh, that's an odd different uh, problem to uh, game while you're hungry. Yeah, and there comes the agent. And um, yeah, I've added two games to the, the stream list. I might actually do them after we're done with Orcs Must Die uh, Three. We'll still have to we still have to do you know, Armed and Dangerous after we're done with Orcs Must Die Two. Um, but if by if the, by the time that we're done with you know, <coughs> Armed and Dangerous, Warchmas Dice 3 hasn't come out yet, then we can put in... Uh, actually, it would be a, probably a bit long for that. Maybe I'd have to fill it up with shorter games instead, if that happens. Yeah, though you did say you wanted to at least wait for reviews uh, of Warchmas Dice 3. True. So, okay, maybe we'll stick in something else. Just to be sure. Okay. Is there a plan B? It's 
probably someone going to run up. And uh, they seem a bit nonplussed about someone getting shot. <laughs> oh, the agent is <laughs> the agent is pissing her corners. But yeah, no, none of the civilians seem to actually give a fuck. Okay, sniper. Okay, then. I, I was expecting someone to run up. Hmm. Does that mean that the moment she starts running, a sniper appears somewhere? Hmm. What if we need to kill the sniper first? Well, if it's plan B, then they probably won't be peeking out yet. Only like when we kill the waiter. But we can look around still, yeah. Okay, so the moment we shoot the glass and the waiter, we need to start looking around fast. I'm guessing the shooter would probably be somewhere around here. Or maybe even here. Since, yeah, there's nothing really too much over here to shoot from. Or at least have an open line of fire. Yeah, it's probably from the east or north. Hmm. I do wonder if... Can we shoot the waiter early or something? Yeah, let's try that. We can get the <clears throat> the waiter and the glass in one shot whilst he's holding it. Yeah, do I have to agree question the ID behind this plan. Like if you know she's going to get poisoned, at least tell her. Yeah, maybe not have a sniper to shoot the damn glass. Okay, he's out. She's running. Oh. Okay, so he literally just popped up the moment we shot. He killed the poisoner. He could... Okay, that, I don't know what that said there. <laughs> you killed the you poisoner before you could try. Point. I think you just got good bonus points. How did the enemy figure my, figured my location that they figure out? Over and over, I revisited those maps and plans, but still can't find the slip. Through the spyglass, from afar, I followed Katie's steps. She noticed the target's movement. They were coming my way. Suddenly, she started driving attention to herself. Drawing should be that. Damn it, why did she protect me and not the other way around? Okay, so, yeah, Survivor's Guild. Watson, Mr. Tic Tac. Luckily, not Mr. Tick uh, Talk. Bomb experts. <laughs> Responsible for many terrorist attacks. Our secret agent have discovered that a terrorist has hidden a bomb that a rock constant and will detonate it remotely. Find and shoot the striped wire to detonate the camouflage bomb then eliminate the terrorist. Okay. So, we have uh, Johnny Test hair, stubble. Music note on the shirt and sunglasses. <laughs> and yeah, this is the second last mission, so we'll have plenty of time. And I kind of... He's a circle, he's a circle, and you know, they all have the hair. Well, most of them. It's striped wire, striped wire. Oh, uh, I would not call that a disguise. Just, did they literally just put a piece of paper on there with a bad mouth and eyebrows? Okay, let's find this idiot. And they all have the freaking shirts. I should have expected that. I think I see him. Where? Up, up, up. And to the west. 
He's the one with the circle head without any of under him. Uh, oh. Yeah, yeah. And... Mission failed. The bomb exploded. Right as we're going to shoot him. But... For such a genius bomb maker, why the hell is he even in the same square as that thing? Okay, is he still there? Okay, he's turned away now. Oh, fuck. Oh! There it is. Okay, look around. That's not him, he hasn't had it, he doesn't have a head. Wait, he's fucking them down there. What is that one down there? Down. You, you, if you're pointing at the, <laughs> if you're pointing at the street, I can't see that. <laughs> okay, yeah, so a bit stupid instinct to do. <laughs> okay, hair, stubble, glasses. Uh, okay, this is the first time that the location of the purpose randomizes relatives. The bomb is on the same spot again. Yeah. Uh, wrong expression. Ah. Okay, didn't show up the target thing like last time. Achievement unlocked, searching for answers. I can't forget the sight of them coming at her. I managed to shoot three of them, but the last one hit her hard. I couldn't look anywhere but at you on the ground. John had to pull me out by force so we wouldn't get caught. That image still haunts me till this day. Hmm. Oh, and... Voice meter has gone robotic. I still don't know how I can prevent that from happening. And fixed again. At least it's just a, a two-click fix. And I do not get why it that keeps happening. Oh, yeah. Last mission. Oh, oh, unknown. Strategist, military, responsible for many terrorist attacks. Our secret agent failed on discovering the identity of one of the worst terrorists in history, but they reported that he is wearing a top hat. Find and eliminate terrorists. So we're going after Mr. Moneybags. Top hats and square. That's face is unfamiliar. Oh, is that him? Yep. Oh, uh, what? The, what the? <laughs> Come the fuck on. <laughs> okay, that's. Just almost comical. I finally found you. You will not escape, damn you. Wait. Katie? What the hell is going on? Unbelievable. Was everything a setup? How could I be so stupid? In this mission, you can't decide what to do. You can choose to kill the terrorist. John will not complete the mission at all. Was that supposed to be that friend Katie that got shot there? Eh? What the heck is going on? Yeah, well, shoot him, I say. Uh, well, it, mission completed. You earned 2,000 points. What? Day 12. Adventure complete. What the hell John was doing there? I need to figure out what's going on. John! Yeah, wait, there's more. Email. Eh? Huh? There will be consequences for disobeying direct orders. Wait in the apartment, a team will collect you. Congratulations, you have completed the adventure and now replay is available. You can increase your score by repeating any missions you want. Are you curious about what's next in this story and Andrew's saga? We open the topic, what would you like to see in the next chapter? Okay, so... Okay, so... <laughs> there, there's going to be a sequel? Or there was... Plan to be a sequel? Eh? <laughs> okay. Uh... 
Well, okay, a part of me is curious. Yeah, same here. But the other end is, uh, well, we completed the story with this. So let's move on to Gunpoint. I have played this game before. I never finished it before. Uh, share it to the here. Yay! And then have come on OBS recognize it. You recognized it earlier. Um, windowed mode nineteen uh, twenty by twelve hundred. Try it. Okay, will you recognize it now? Come on, you recognized it earlier in the testing. The hell. Accept. Don't tell me it's just refusing to work. No. The hell. What's happening? It. It's refusing to find the game. Uh, start from... Come on, will we recognize it now? Specific window. It's not... It's not showing up in there. Okay then. Uh, change resolution. If we go full screen then. Try it. Okay. Capture full screen. Come on. There we go. Okay, you still have sight? I still have sight. Okay, I, I don't know what was going on there. Uh, yeah, start from scratch. Did you just get thrown out of the you know, plate gap? Out of a plate glass window. No. Several meters into another building. I work at the gun company across the road. Someone just got thrown out of your apartment window. I don't want to talk <laughs> about it. <laughs> I was actually about to call you about something else, but now I'm more interested in this. <laughs> well, try to move on. What did you need? My name is Selena uh, Delgado. My boss, Rook, says you are some kind of freelance spy. I might have a job for you. Want to come up? Sure, buzz me in. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, A and D to move around. And, oh, light switch, hand and the guards can use. Oh, yeah, yeah, we can jump around like this. That's one way to make an entrance. Yeah. Up and down at the stairs and... Well, fuck. Uh, we need to throw to talk to the person. Let's see, Atlas Gaming, me drinks from my bottle of cola, then spits it out the moment I hear the name Selena. <laughs> what? <laughs> In case it's not obvious, long falls don't kill you. And, uh, yeah, we... Oops. Hey, uh, yeah, let's just run. 69 seconds earlier. Congratulations. Congratulations on purchasing your new Bullfrog brand Hyper Trousers. Caution, a maximum strength jump may shatter glass ceilings, windows, and children. What? Outdoor use only. Hmm. Oh, that's how... Hey. <laughs> oh, 
Wait, is it all in order? No, that was oh. the intro. <laughs> Oh, okay. Conway, this is Melanie Rook. Celine Delego worked for me. Do you have time to talk? How Wait, do you know my name? It's on your profile. It's on your phone's <laughs> public ID, and you once gave it to me on a business card while saying, My name is Conway. Continue. I know you didn't kill Selena. I just watched the footage. You walked right in front of a security camera on your way to Selena's office after the shots were fired. But the East Point police won't look beyond an easy conviction. That footage puts you at the scene and I have to turn it over to them. Okay, so yeah, nice to see that even fictional police hardly do their work. And why do you care? Selena was a friend. I want a real killer caught. In fact, I want him dead, but once he's in a jail cell, it becomes simpler to achieve. I have to hand that footage over if I have it. Let's make sure I don't have it. I've wiped my copy, but my camera feeds get backed up to data centers in five different off-site locations. If you can wipe them all, you're in the clear, and the police will have to find a real killer. Okay, that's some good back, yeah, security backup. Uh, why can't you wipe it remotely? If you know, could write it remotely, there wouldn't be any point in storing it remotely. Head to the data set yes, facility at Port Heath. Uh, or P Heath. I'll make sure the front door is open, but you'll have to take it from there. Look, it's disconnected. Yeah, there's a bit of a conversation system in this. It doesn't make too many differences, but you can get some really funny things out of it. <laughs> Rook, caught on camera. The footage of you at the murder scene has been automatically backed up to five different locations. This is the closest. Get in there and wipe the data. First, we get paid 30, 30 bucks for this. Oh, come on. And yeah, we get a little jazz music as well. So I'll have to keep an eye on the game volume to see if it's not getting drowned out. On the top floor of this building, there is there is a bank of servers with a computer nearby. If you can get to that, you can wipe the evidence that you were at our offices when Selena was killed. Okay, how do I wipe the data? I've seen your record. This will be well within your abilities. Once you're in, the scrubber script I'm sending you will auto-wipe everything with today's date ending in, an M in MP4. Okay, how do I get in? I read one of our tech guys open the front door for you. The electrical systems are hackable from here, but for obvious reasons, their servers aren't. Thank you. Hold down the left mouse button to aim a jump. It takes a moment to charge up to full strength. You can always adjust the strength of a jump by moving the mouse. Like this is the highest that we can jump. And we <laughs> we just land flat on our back, you know, on our belly. And we land like that. Let's see. I already had a Hero Academia flashback. We can climb up and down walls. Oh, and what? Let's see. Let's see. Can we Is climb this Okay, we can't jump through windows like this, but we can jump away from them. So we can just head in. We can interact with items when we stand near them, like turning on the, yeah, turning off the light, calling and entering elevators. Okay. <laughs> Atlas, Spider-Man, Spider-Man does whatever Spider-Man does. Can he swing <laughs> from the web? Yes, he can. He's Spider-Man. Watch out! Here comes Spider-Man. And that's the '60s rendition of the Spider-Man theme. Your objective is a secure terminal with sensitive information. Yeah, we can hover our mouse around over things like to identify them, like the light switch, summon the elevator, guards in this floor will heal it arrive. No, hear it arrive. Why do, why do I keep mixing up R's and L's at sometimes? Good question. And I always say this to Atlas Games. You deserve a pat on the head. And I just noticed something here. 
optional ejector. From Major Julian, Chief of Police, to East Point, all private security. I've heard rumbling lately from some officers about your private security assignments. Since we merged with the city's largest security firm, the, East, the EPPD now serves both roads. Yeah, that sounds like a very bad idea. I don't like working for a corporation, but your job is the same, protect and serve. With the endless budget cuts we've been through, the new funding from this merger is the only reason you even have a half, have even halfway adequate equipment. Basically, tough. Mayfield. Okay. Atlas again. Not this game gives me Gotham vibes for some reason. Gotham? Yeah, Gotham, like uh, Gotham City, Batman. Uh, yeah, I get that. Yes, a bit surprised. And also, I gotta say this: in Atlas Gaming, you deserve a cookie instead <laughs> for the Spider-Man yolk. Let's noise level time. We took our time. An empty bar is the fastest time it's not possible. A full net bar is double that. So, okay. Amount of noise. Noisy. Says neighbors could have heard smashing glass and gunshots, or <laughs> us jumping through the freaking ring. Witnesses, anyone who might have seen you, including anyone you pounced on but didn't kill. Violence, kills count for a lot, gunshots, long falls, and 10 plus punches. <laughs> the 10 plus punches killed. Knockouts and electrical shocks don't. And the amount of secondary <coughs> objectives, client rating, will fill optional objectives if there were any. Okay. We got an upgrade point and 30 bucks. Good job. <laughs> Walking through already open doors is my specialty. <laughs> Our feeds are backed up to four more facilities. The others are slightly better guarded, but not nothing too taxing. I'll give you their addresses in order of security, since frankly I have no idea <laughs> how good you are. <laughs> Thanks for giving my personal crisis a difficulty curve. <laughs> Anytime. You'll see a mission briefing on a, you know, for a job on Proudmore Drive. Take it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Atlas. Listen, first a girl called, named you know, Selena, then the music, and thus dark slash night city environment, raid and all the breaking windows and PDA reading. This might as well be Gotham, and the chats give me <laughs> solid vibes as well. Jesus. <laughs> uh. Guarded. The second backup from the cameras that caught you at the murder scene is on Proudmore Drive. Get in, wipe the data, and get out. Okay. Westfield facility has better security. My guy can open the front door for you, but the door to the server room is secure. Two guards working tonight. Whoever is in the server room can probably open the door to it, so get in to do it for you. Isn't that kind of the opposite of a guard job's description? It is, but these guys spend more time dealing with electrical faults than professional spies. It shouldn't be hard to outwit them. Guards will shoot on sight. The cursor turns red in areas guards can, guards can see. Jump on a guard to pin him to the ground. And I just love the picture here, even if it's a little bit little. <laughs> that, that would make for a... Per that's actually perfect for a Discord profile. <laughs> Uh, Atlas again, right when you react, my internet decides to drop the ball. Tough. <laughs> hmm. Oh, I like this. Rain noise. And slightly yep. less rain noise, or a lot less rain noise. Let's see, is there anything we can mess with? Because this guy will shoot on sight. Super. Yeah, now I can hear the rain voice. And this game is very quiet, so I can raise the volume for once a bit more. And, yeah, that, that's what happens if you... they No, they get you, of course. You die in one shot. Okay, how can I outwit this guy? Actually... There we go. <laughs> just knock him the fuck out. <laughs> okay, switch. And Spider-Man. Spider-Man jumps a guard just because he can. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
and out. Okay, non-lethal. But they both well witnessed us. <laughs> we don't even have a match. They got a, a good look at our face. The second one we could have dodged, but oh well. Okay. We have eighty-five dollars now and two upgrade points. Crossed wires to get into the Ellis and Street facility. You need to rewire the building's electronics. If you don't have a crosslink, buy one. Okay, upgrades: Bullfrog, Jump Strength, Charge Up Time. Okay, nothing too important now. Here we go: Crosslink, Rewire Electrical Devices. This is the second gameplay feature of this game. Let's see: Rewire Secure System Circuits. Land silently from any height. That sounds good. That's Luke. Another good, <laughs> another good Discord profile. Some incoming shots miss. Muffled breaking glass. That that'll be useful. Prank spasm. Booby track ele electronics. <laughs> okay, I don't think the guards will care much about. It's just a prank, bro. Long shot. Rewire enemy guns. <laughs> okay. okay. Resolver? And gate crashes, kick down doors, and there's still room for more. Wait. How? Kicking down the door is the most expensive upgrade. Apparently. What the heck? I can't open the server room on Ellis Street, and there are no guards working tonight. You'll have to do it yourself. How? Any building wired in the last 20 here puts everything on a single powered grid. The way things are connected is all, handler, is all handled in software, and software can be hacked. If you've got a crosslink, you can see all the connections and drag them around to work however you want, make a light switch, open a door, whatever. That doesn't seem like a great security feature. It's not. Anyone who's actually expecting a hacker puts all their important stuff on an isolated circuit. The data here is a backup of a backup of a backup. They're more worried about hard drive failures than spies. It actually is a crosslink. This is the mod for your phone that lets you hack into a building's electronics and rewire stuff. Some, elect some security geek put it out in closed beta. The only people using it are espionage operatives and asshole kids. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh, Atlas, the voice in your head is dying of laughter, yeah. <laughs> okay, got it. And oh, start the mission. Let's That's switch to mouse mode with the mouse wheel or left alt. Click and drag a line to any device to link it to any other. If you link from the door and switch to the door, the switch can open the door. The direction matters, linking it the other way around won't do anything. That's not so saying. That's just gaming. There are some videos out on YouTube where you can hear me really break apart. Enough that I end up on the floor. I think at least twice so far. No, no. More. I think... And not so that... more, actually. I still took our time with that. Mains. The next terminal is on Loxley Close. By the way, be careful with your power sockets. They'll emit a shock if you cross-link something to them. Yep. Yeah. And that'll be a way for us to, well, incapacitate guards. Let's see. Where Wait. are any power sockets here? Did you say guards or cars? The guards, I think. <laughs> I said that at least. Oh. Alright, alright. That light isn't tied to anything here. But we... Oh wait, that's a handprint scanner, not a button. Hmm. And this door is locked. So we really have no other option but then to punch this guy out. And... No way. I was in the wrong mode there. Link that to that. And 
actually, we can just do this instead. And he's out. <laughs> Since we're here, there we go. Hack this thing. And out. What a friend from the way. Alien, Atlas Gaming, for games like this you need Red Bull. Red Bull gives you wings. <laughs> <laughs> I think I actually stopped with... Uh, they still run the, the commercials, but they don't actually give characters wings again, but they still use the slogan. Oh, Alien, sorry to disappoint you. They're still doing that. Okay, at least as far as I'd seen. And this is Sweden. We're still doing, we're still doing the wings. Free for all. Last one and you're clear. The data suck place on Gerswing and Forth is the biggest and most lively guarded. But after this, there will be no evidence linking you to Selina's murder. This is the last facility where the copy of the footage, but it's stored on three different servers. You'll need to get uh, to three different terminals and hack each one. Are you seeing anyone about your backup addiction? <laughs> well, you never know when a suspected murderer is going to try systematically erasing them. I guess you should actually be backing up more. <laughs> Good luck. Uh. <laughs> Atlas, the venom from DC that makes Bane stronger is just an exaggerated version of Monster Energy Drink. <laughs> uh. Okay, this time we have cameras to deal with as well. Let's see. We can probably lure that guy out. Okay, three places. Any electrical sockets? Okay, there is one here. Hmm. Okay, let's disconnect all of these. Uh, actually, let's disconnect that. With, that. with that button not working, this guy will be trapped in that room. do this now that guy is just walking around okay, let's unlock that switch it to this button actually or, oh, no I need it okay we, you can link things to other things which will cause them to activate um, So let's disconnect that. Oh, wait, yeah. Okay, I didn't think that door was open. Uh, me not paying attention to the stream, and here's she talking about disconnecting something. Also, me. Ah, yes, cut off his Wi Fi. <laughs> okay. Oh, the door, the door was open. Okay. Then disconnect that. Connect that. So that, and now when we head for it, it'll lock the guy in the room for now. And actually, we can we can go back down for a second. There, open the door. Oh wait, that's going to draw their attention. <laughs> I forgot about the other guy who turned around. Okay, so we need... To... Actually, let's just turn off all the lights all at once. Right there. There, disconnect that. And there, disconnect that. Oh, disconnect that one as well. And there we go. Full dark. <laughs> and we knocked that guy out with the fucking door. <laughs> I'd actually forgotten about that. So let's just wait for number two to come back around. Ah. Timing was off. Okay, let's try it with this door then. <laughs> uh. 
We can, we can just tie it directly to the door. <laughs> and there we go. <laughs> uh. What's next? You, you, you put in uh, deadly traps on stairway. That's it. Oh, no, that's not a game, but that's a video, though. Oh, uh. gosh. I wonder if that is on YouTube. Guards don't see you when you're in an elevator. Okay. Well, that makes sense. Well, at least until they check the elevator. I don't think they do. Lazy burglars. <clears throat> I think cameras can't see you in the dark. Uh, better not risk it, and we've already spent enough time here. Let's see how this again. Man, it must suck taking your ages, uh, taking ages to register idea in a building, only for some random dude to delete all the data. So on the next day, he doesn't recognize you. Uh. <laughs> well, I think that concludes our business. There's nothing left that links you to Celine's murder, so the East Point police are going to have to look a little harder. If they don't find him, I will. If they do, I'll know exactly where he is. Appreciate the help, whatever the reasons. Indeed. Okay. Case notes. Prospective client, Lena Delego, was shot and killed her in an office. Cameras caught me on my way up to see her, making me the prime suspect. Selena's boss, Melanie Rook, knows I'm innocent and wants to re-kill her compot. She helped me wipe the off-site the backups of the incriminating footage I'm in the clear. Let's see. Collins, innocent. Hi, sorry to bother you guys. I don't know if this is the right place to post it, but I've just been arrested for murder and I don't really know anyone, so I'm using my one call to post this. Hope you can help. Katie. 300 pay. Requires wirejack. It's... Uh, it, no, no, wrong thing. Wirejack. We, well, we have just enough for that, so now, now we can buy, go buy a candy bar. Hi, right, thanks so much for replying. J.D. Collins, analyst, Rook Firearms. Optional objective, check in your laptops. <laughs> for this money, even lowercase eyes can't keep me away. <laughs> Same as before. Uh -huh, sorry, my typing's not great. I borrowed this phone from a sex worker and I haven't figured out how to do capitals on it yet. My name's Katie Collins, I work at Rook, the gun company, and my friend Selena was killed last night. Someone's saying they saw me there, and all the security footage has been deleted. Well, that's kind of a dig move by somebody. I know, I wasn't there at all last night, but I live alone so I can't prove it without the footage. What can I do? Uh, Atlas again, on the day of registration, access granted. On the next day, ID unknown, access denied. And in my head, access to night sounded like it, it did in Half-Life. <laughs> the person saying they saw me there is Melanie Rook's husband, Jackson. I don't want to get anyone in trouble, but maybe you could stop by his building and see just what's going on. Her husband? To get him in trouble, I'd want to get him in acid. <laughs> A bit, uh, you have to shut uh, yes, we should be forgiving of everyone involved in this. Yeah, he always seems so nice, so I just want to figure out why he'd do this. He'll probably be in his office on the top floor. If you can get close enough to hear what he's saying, maybe you could listen in for a clue or something. And then throw him in some acid? <laughs> Please, no acid. I just want to know what's going on. Got it. <laughs> Thank you so much. I hate to be a pain, but I really want to get out of here. It's scary. And wait, they're in jail. They got the phone from a sex worker. Yeah, someone smuggled something in. More like the, she said that she used the. Oh, she probably used a regular phone first, then borrowed the, that phone. Yeah, from someone else who's also in jail. Uh. <laughs> uh. Atlas, also, IS, Childhood, Half-Life. 
We now have life one, spam C on the scanner, scanners, access denied, now let get lost. <laughs> Okay. And now you folks know why Hillian will make a bad detective. Here's the violent. See, I can get sneaky. Yeah, let's see. I can't imagine you uh, thinking you're about to die from falling. Hmm. Not the frog. Let's see. We link you to that. Hmm. Open says me. Get to the green red circuit box and use it. You'll be able to rewire thing on the green, things on the green circuit. Devices on different colored circuits can be linked to each other. Yeah, they're making things a bit more difficult now. And now we've yet again been seen on the camera. I'm a bit concerning if they made anything easier as the time goes on. Uh, You've got a good that interesting game. At the start of the game is the hardest, but every time every level gets easier and easier. Okay, we just need to. Are those freaking cruise missiles in there? I think so. No, Intex have that whole call recorded. Well, thank you, Captain Hindsight. I didn't know they were bugging me. Can't hear a bug, it's not the fucking 90s. <laughs> Alright, I'll let you know. And. Okay. Face in his hands. It was the husband that killed the Serene. I didn't get a, too much of a good look at the guy, but it seems... I think he's being blackmailed or something. He seems like he's in despair and thoughtful again. We missed a laptop, okay. Let's see. Atlas, can I just say that guy has a stomach of steel so many falls that he just gets up perfectly fine <laughs> as if he fell on a bouncy castle or something like that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Hey, what happened? Did you hear anything? He says a company called Intex have an incriminating record of recording of him. Oh, they are our main rivals, a big multinational company who just opened an office here in East Point. Uh, yeah, I think that's pretty obvious. He's a big guy in the op company. Uh, of course, they'd be recording anything for blackmail. Any idea what Jackson would be saying that he shouldn't? Oh god, I don't want to think, kid. But if he's trying to frame me, maybe he's involved with Selena's death somehow. What do you think? Yeah. Any idea why they'd be recording Jackson's phone calls? Well, Jackson runs his own company, but is a dummy. It's a dummy company for Rook. Intex would definitely want to hear his calls. This is really messed up, but thanks for doing this. I think it's gonna be a huge help. Hmm. So we have two companies, rivals. Uh, yeah, someone was uh, one of them was murdered, but we don't know if they were actually that high up. They did have a top floor suite or office. Let's see, Gessler, industrial espionage. Need a pro for some deniable ops work. Disgusting pay. Yeah, disgusting low. And K Collins, Intex hates Katie again. I think we need to get a hold, get hold of Jackson's incriminating recording. Let me know if you're up for it. Thanks, Katie. Let's see. She pays more even. Okay. She pays for and she's in Yale. Okay, we, we just get these points normally. We don't have to pay for them. Uh, oh, hello. Hello. How fitting. It's raining game and in real life. <laughs> Heavily. Let's see. Let's buy this one. And we can one return it. So if we... <laughs> If it proves to be not as useful at the moment, we can <laughs> just hand it back in. Okay, let's go with Katie's. Time let's go. plenty. Uh, I'd like to know what's going on. Uh, 
I really like to know what's going now uh, what you know, what's on that recording. I don't want to get Jackson arrested or anything, but if the recording proves he framed me, I really need to get that out of I needed to get out of here. And you were going to say? I was to ask, can you hear the rain from my mic? No. Oh, that's good. <laughs> okay, optional objective, minimal violence. Agreed, what's the plan? We could just start straight out, but there's chat options, so let's chat. Rook told me once that Intact Base are all their duty ops out of their office on Marlow Street. If you can get in, the recording should be on the main terminal there. Like I think, got it. Conway, thanks. Okay. Oh, our last name. Basically saying thank you, dude. <laughs> okay, let's see. We have two guards. Uh, we have a yellow circuit there. We asked to minimize our violence. And let's disconnect that. Switch that and jump on the roof. And disconnect it again. And the moment we're disconnecting that and connecting that to the door. So the moment he walks through the door. There we go. Now let's wire jack into that. And let's disconnect that. That. Oh, no. oh yeah, we can't since it's we can't connect red to red, but not red to green. So we open that door up. And that was already connected. There we go. We should go exploring now. So in the meantime, we open the door. Okay, we need to, oh, do we need to go all the way around to have that activate that? Okay. Down. Walk him in. Open that up. And there we go. It, head to the subway when you're ready. Uh, Atlas, this character, you know, the character falls from the orbit of the planet and hits the ground, then gets up perfectly fine and runs away from the scene. <laughs> Basically. Did you find anything? Gone, I'm afraid, but a server lock certainly was once downloaded by a Rook IP. Okay. So, uh, hmm. Rook downloading from. Intex uh, device server. Well, maybe that was Jackson. If you send me the IP, I might know which office it came from, and maybe we can get it from there. Uh, has been arrested from her murder. Jan Mark Jackson <clears throat> is claiming he saw comments there at night. I heard uh, Jackson referring to an incriminating recording to a company called Intex out of him. The recording has been deleted from Intex servers, but the log shows someone had to work without a copy. Okay, the recording. I know which office downloaded the recording of Jackson. If you, if you can get it, you can have everything I have left. 400 pay. Hmm. <clears throat> Hey, this could be really dangerous, so it's okay if you want to back out. This is my last chance, and it'll only work if the recording is what we hope it is. You just went three sentences without an exclamation mark, Katie. What's wrong? Uh, it's just kind of scary in here. I've got no alibi. I'm one of the only people who could have wiped that footage, and Jackson's word carries a lot of weight. I don't want to get you in trouble for a lost cause. Uh, I'm not. I'm, yeah, it's not lost till I'm done. At which point, yeah, it, it'd be totally lost. I don't get trouble. Trouble gets in. Okay, that's one. That one's not going anywhere. <laughs> Thank you. Good luck. Okay, another minimal 
have the violence one. Bulky guards are enforcers. Enforcers can be pinned down or bashed. Jumping into one staggers him a little. Oh. Yeah, we're getting up to this already now. Let's hope oh, we can jump in from the roof. From the roof. And we can't play Mission Impossible music, so no, no. Okay, that draw their attention. <laughs> Let's well, yeah. What what would you seriously expect to happen if you jump through onto three layers of windows? Oh. <laughs> and we just got shot off the floor. <laughs> uh. Okay, restart. Well done, boy. Well done. Uh, did you know Quakers, cousins of the kangaroos, love and toss their children at predators to escape? <laughs> this is what Alice is out. They're friendless and cuteness, horrible <laughs> parenting. Oh god, I've I seen a YouTube video being recommended to me about that. And I think I've forgot to watch it so far. Okay, that only broke one window uh, of the windows. Turn. And then we can oh, head in after the room. Actually, no, we should break another of those windows. Hmm. I think they. I think he took aim at me there. And they up. We jumped out of their sight. Okay, uh, quick switch that. And oh, we can jack into this. We can hide up there. And let's see, yellow, yellow. That guy is not leaving that place, it seems. Hmm. Oh, the only way into that one is to the aura. light up there and then we open up that door so we can go and jack into the blue system Atlas again oh speak of the devil I you got back a minute a video about what because I know she need parenting uh, crack a parent oh god please take it and let me live fuck a child <laughs> I'm in danger I'm in danger. I I cannot do a Ralph voice. Ralph? What? Uh, Ralph from Simpsons. Oh. Okay, let's. Oh, hello. A motion detector triggers when anyone walks nearby. So we're not taking the, the <laughs> we're not taking the elevator down. Okay, auto save five seconds ago. Yeah. And then we hang on the roof for a bit. Was he taking aim at me there? Okay. Here we go. Do that. And then link that to that. Because he's going to press it. And there we go. Minutes of complete. And um, how will you escape now? Like that. Flat. Alright, you didn't land flat this time. Okay, we got seen by a few of them. And we missed the laptop. Again. 
Crackers make polar bears look like normal parents, which says something because the males will eat their smaller ones should they starve for long enough and find no food. <laughs> oh god. Did you get it? No luck, someone surely scrubbed it for, from that machine. Oh. I'm sorry Katie, don't pay me for this one, we'll keep working on it. It's really sweet of you, but I'm still sending you the money. I can't use it. I just don't know what to do now. I don't know why someone would want to frame me like this, I think. I hate thinking someone hates me yeah, that much. They went through all the trouble to delete every copy of the security video that showed I wasn't there. Mm, we'll fix it. <laughs> Maybe. Collins is disconnected. That third line there was basically going to towards uh, <laughs> that asshole was me. Sorry. Let's see, we have a bunch of cash. Let's try it out. Okay. That's fluke. No. Muffle breaking glass. Let's buy that, since we've been getting a lot of noise. Booby trap electronics. Hmm. Power capacity, store more charge for your gadgets. Okay, we don't have any of that, but we can probably put in two just to get some. Let's see. Atlas, the wilderness is brutal, man. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let, let's take a look at this. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Conway <laughs> Hat Fancer, who the fuck are you? <laughs> oh, let's it's the Intex CEO. Yeah, because I was to point that out. Uh, I was suspecting that. And optional objective, leave no uh, living witnesses. Okay. The fuck does that mean? Fuck, it, you'll do. Can't get a uh, goddamn spy in the city. Gessler CEO Intex. I need some uh, someone serious. Are you? There's a... I don't know what the hell that is. <laughs> I am serious and don't call me Shirley. Uh, that, that's a reference. Whatever, I make guns, Rook make guns, Rook's working on some bullshit secret projects she thinks is going to let her get around the gun ban, and she doesn't think I know about it. You're going to steal it. Okay, I'm not wild about stealing from Rook. Christ, look, I don't care if you're fucking her, it's a corporation. This is business, and it's getting done whoever does it. Unless you're a goddamn employee, I suggest you look at this ridiculous fucking fee again and sign on the figure of the fucking line. <laughs> uh, you mean that pay of $100? Where is it? Good point. First, you're gonna find where it is. He's outsourcing all the work to a company called TX Fabrications to keep it secret. Hit her admin center on Bell Side Way and search the main terminal. Now will text you the code name you're looking for. Any special requests? Look, I don't judge assets by how well they blither into their fucking phones, so the jury's still out on you. If you want to impress me now or any time you're on Intex Ops, don't leave witnesses. Anyone does see you, don't leave them breathing, don't care how many hits it takes. Thanks for the tip, Gandhi. <laughs> Okay, so it's not kill everyone, it's just don't get spotted. Or if you get spotted, don't let anyone, <laughs> don't tell him, let them live. Basically, leave no witnesses alive. Yeah. Let's... Which means, yeah, we probably want to turn on him at later point. True. Now let's trap door here. going to be a bit tricky, I think, since we're going to need to get into that. Actually, uh, is he going to walk over that? Oh, <laughs> it's not like I thought it was. Okay, then. Um, let's see, we can connect that outlet and make it spark. That guard is not moving yet. Is that the soul? Wait, 
oh, the trap door closed. Okay. Okay, and he's just going to. Oh, it, it just opens up temporarily. Wait, what? Hmm. Why is the trap doors? Uh, I don't know. Uh, let's see what happens if we do that. Okay, let's just let's just hope he that knocked him out and then outright kill him. Okay. Oh, hold on a second. Oh, the camera can't see us in the dark. Oops, more evidence are against us then. Well done. Well done, Hylia. Okay, he heard the <coughs> he heard the elevator, so he turned around, which allows us to jack into there. And then we can work on the lights. Nicely. Oh, hold on, we can do this there. Okay. And then do that. Hack it. And are there any. Are there no laptops, I think? And. Thank you. And there we go. La I didn't see any laptops, okay. Yeah, those things probably have some extra hints and stuff for us, or at least lore. Get it? Got it. The prototypes at a TX fabrication facility on bio. Fucking A. You'll hear from me when we're ready to move. And call. Rook, the prototype. Conway, get in touch. There's something you should know about your Intax contract. Okay, so how how do you know I actually she probably saw the camera footage and saw her fucking face on it? <laughs> mm. okay. Yeah, that, okay, there's a lot going on here. Anonymous, the Collins case. I'm unsatisfied with the East Point EPPD's handling of a recent homicide, and I'm looking for an agent to help me investigate what really happened. And uh, let's look into that. Uh, we, we kind of got Katie stuck in that position. So we and that jackass of a husband. So uh, let's see. Here. You and that jackass of a husband got into the world. I'm innocent in all this. <laughs> so don't bug me for your problems, good sir. <laughs> Thanks for responding. The case I'm interested in is one you might have heard of. The victim's name was Selena. Delgado, an employee of the Rook Firearms Company. Client identity encrypted, minimal violence objective. Yes, I'm familiar with it. The security camera footage from the murder scene was wiped and Delgado's colleague, Katie Collins, was charged with the murder. I don't think she did it and I'd like you to help prove that. Let me guess, you were a friend of the suspect. Let me guess, you knew the victim. Don't make me guess, why do you care? <laughs> I'm the chief of police, <laughs> okay, just straight out with it. <laughs> You're hiring me to investigate your own incompetence, cool. <laughs> no, the departments. I was transferred here to do something about this town's atrocious record for corruption, and every other police chief who's been giving that task has vanished or died in a freak gun accident. I'm not them. I intend to do some actual good here. And to do that, I need to stay alive. So when it gets hard to tell whether my men are being lazy, stupid, or actually corrupt, it seems wiser to not ask them directly. That's why I need you. So basically, he's Gordon, and we're Batman. <laughs> What's the plan? We're, we're, we're Batman with pants. Big springy pants. <laughs> You're Crocman. Every offsite backup of that camera, uh, uh, of that security camera feed was wiped that night, but the camera itself wasn't. Not everyone knows it, but the older models Vroknia uses keep a local backup on the camera itself. I want you to go to the crime scene and get the camera's memory cards. 
And that uh, would show you whoever was caught on camera there that night. Hopefully, yes. If it's blank, we keep digging. So where am I headed? Uh, Wedgwood Road, the Rook Office. Just get to the camera on the third floor. It should be easy to get the card out. The data will be strongly encrypted, but I can decode it if you can get it to me. Ooh. Okay, yeah, now we're working against our own interest a bit, and they still they haven't replaced the ceiling light. The ceiling window. Oh, but we have a guard here now. Let's, let's open that up. As well as turn this off, just in case. Actually... We can get the guard's attention to the other side. Oh, that's locked. Okay. Oh dear. Okay, we go up one. And we jack in here. That's it. Yeah, it's the lights in this door. Turn that off. Turn that up. that to that just in case actually hmm. if we go further he's going to see us how do we get his attention away? Free pizza? <laughs> but yeah. say that wouldn't work. Off just to be sure, open that up, and we can tie the light switch to the elevator button so it will call it and distract him. But if we do this, will that get his attention? No. Mm. I think we're going to have to pounce him. There's an optional objective. Okay. Open that door. Let's see, is there anything juicy in here? From Rook to Selena. Let us stick around. I know the figures look bad and I know they're getting worse. There's a gun ban and we're a gun company. We can't afford cutbacks. But bear with me, I can't talk about it yet, even internally. They have something in the pipeline that can more than save us, and might even run Intex out of town. I'm sure by now you're getting headhunted. I'd be trying to poach you if you worked for anyone else. I'll understand if you get an offer you, you, <coughs> you have to take. Just don't think Rook is a dead end, your persistence not in any danger. By the way, if Mark's still there, let him know I'll be late tonight. His mobile's off. Okay. <laughs> Did you get the cards? Um, 
it's probably best if we don't send the data. Yep, but there's nothing on it. And that's suspicious. Very few people know about the onboard uh, uh, backup on that model. I can't think why someone would wipe the card and then go into all the trouble of putting it back in. Thank you for your help. Anyway, I'll get back to you when I know our next move. Okay, bullet dodge. Let's see. Half muffles breaking glass. Battery. Current battery charge. Okay, we picked up uh, a battery earlier with the trap doors. Actually, I wonder if you did really did. If he's there to get rid of corruption and all that, maybe showing the, the videos to prove you were innocent would be a good idea. Yeah, but he'd have to use it in court. And yeah, then, then we'd be back at the beginning of the game with them accusing us of being the killer, even though the evidence showing that it's not. And yeah, if, yeah. if, the, if the police have been privatized, then I don't want to take a guess if the ju if the justice system is the same. Oh God! Let's try this. The prank spasm. Hmm. And let's max out the charge. Or actually, let's lower that a bit. Hmm. And let's go full on with that. And the rest of the points will go into the jump strength. If we get that high enough. We should probably be able to get some shortcuts through windows. <clears throat> Let's see. Mayfield, the data suck recording. I need you to break into a data suck facility to get some footage that might shed light on who killed Selena the Lake. Delgado. Okay, he's had a better pay. You got a break. One of the data suck facility you know, is the murderer broke into that night had a security camera. Unfortunately, I can't get a warrant for the footage without letting my men know I've reopened the case. So needs to get it for me. You think the guy who wiped footage didn't wipe the footage of him wiping the footage? <laughs> Did any of the guards see him? None who could give a usable description. Guy in a coat was my favorite. <laughs> uh. <laughs> he may not be a clever man. So if I get this, we'll know who he is. Some of these dialogue options do change things a bit to my knowledge, but yes, when it's not, then all of these are available to us. If you walk in front of that camera, we'll know what he looks like. He might he not be in our database, so we'll still need to figure out how to find him. Alright, how do we do it? Just get to the terminal at their main servers on the ground floor. The data will probably be encrypted again, so just copy it and send it to me when you get out. Sure, I'll definitely do exactly that. <laughs> and exactly not do that, because then it's our ass on the line again. Let's see. Nothing you hate that a lot going on on this game. I wouldn't be surprised if you have done several mistakes already. Let's see, there's no way for us really in except for the window. Like that, to that. The thing's okay. <laughs> he saw us out the window. Okay, uh, trigger happy much. Oh, I see. We can. It activates when he was nearby, so. <laughs> we can knock ourselves the hell out. Uh. <laughs> uh. Okay, disconnect that. Uh. Okay, let's see. There's actually not any other doors here that we can interact with. Hmm. Oh, the, we can hack Jack in here. Let's see what becomes available now. Sound detector. Okay. 
see. Atlas, this is legit Metal Gear Solid plus Spider-Man plus Batman plus Watch Dogs. <laughs> uh, it is a good little game. Hmm. Yeah, and a bit more comical than expected. Okay, how do we progress from here? Actually, why am I getting a bit vibe of Naked Gun? Uh, not surprised with that. Okay, I see how we can continue. Let's get up there. Uh, actually, not. Hmm. Okay, just stay out of sight. Sound detectors trigger when they hear a sound. They'll pick up on elevator dings on the same floor or loud noises anywhere. When they hear something, they'll activate what they're linked to. Okay, so if we tie that to that, and that to that, and the elevator goes down, and we're in. Okay, blue circuit, the sound detector. Also sealed the door on us. That might explain why we can keep missing the laptop then. Okay, that turned off the light. Let's unlock that. Leave him stuck in there. Activate the switch in here again. Actually, no tie to that. Then this door will open up again. Untie that. And now connect that to that. No. To get yeah, to that door, not to that. That to there. And that'll open up this door as well. Okay. But we need access to the yellow system, which is guarded. Also tied to the yellow system. What the? Oh, come on. I wonder you want to have that fixed. Our objective is here. That laptop is just an extra. So let's get that. Is there a way that we could get that? I, oh, yes, we can. I opening up that door. Actually the other way around that needs to be. Does it uh, let's untie that because that would short circuit I think. Yes. This should open up that door. Yep, yeah, there we go. to untie that one so it closed the door on us again. Okay, up. Now we disconnect that. And there we go. That card must be feeling really confused about uh, <coughs> the elevator going off again and again. Ghost? or he thinks his partner is pranking him. Yeah. Okay, we can't pounce this guy, but we can stick around. Literally. Okay, jack into that, hide in there. Um, okay. You go back. Oh, he doesn't. Wait. I guess it, it can't be being an elevator. Yeah. Almost got seen. I 
already and now that door is open so we can get to the laptop and see what might be on that. Let's see, from Jason, Sarah to Ty Labadini. Labad Rook feeds. So I do know if the feeds from the Rook office across the street get backed up here. Do you have admin rights? If so, you uh, might want to check the footage from the 15th. On that night, I stayed late on my way to the car. I saw a guy making out with some late teenage chick on the top floor. Here's the thing. The guy looked exactly like Mark Jackson. I know I know that chick didn't turn out to be Anna Kendrick at that time, but just check. If I'm right... Okay, so he... The blackmail is likely that he's been cheating. Okay. Uh, of course. It ain't a spy to take the story without cheating. A pairs. Okay. Uh, it's not to suspect that this game is slightly a parody. Uh, yeah. Any luck? Uh, yep, here's where I got up the servers. Random garbage. Not decrypting. You're right. This is just random garbage. Either way, uh, either that or they're using a whole new cipher for some uh, reason. I'll keep working on it and let you know what our next move is. And call. I need you to break into my own HQ. I'll explain why. Okay, we got time for a few more missions, I think. I've discovered evidence that Selena Delago's post-mortem was altered after Katie Collins was arrested. Uh, what I don't know is why. Are my men covering for one of their own, or just changing the facts to fit the easiest suspect to convict? Again, we should not let ourselves hang for this. Uh, we have we have too pretty a hat to hang on anything <laughs> other than a coat, <laughs> a hat rack. What do you want me to do about it? But yeah, falsifying medic, falsifying a coroner's report. Yeah. If you can get to the coroner's computer in our HQ, you might be able to find an autosave of the original somewhere on the on there. If we can see what the difference is, it might confirm whether this is corruption or just laziness. Got it? Can't you, the police of the chief of the actual police, get this police thing from the police? <laughs> Ask my predecessor. You can't. He was shot six times in the chest shortly after referring one of his officers to internal affair for document forgery. I used to say that was even related. <laughs> All right, point taken. Okay. <laughs> yeah. It, <laughs> this is basically uh, Gotham, but less uh, grim, dark, and more noir. And yeah, I know Gotham isn't really grimdark. <laughs> Let's see. Where can... Oh, we can enter through the roof there. Let's not get seen by this guy. Because he seems ready to shoot on the very start. Okay. Okay. Lock him in. Actually, I, w I don't blame the guard. I would be ready to shoot anything if a spring him Jack was in the building. <laughs> and yeah. the person becomes spring him Jack. Well, almost. You haven't really killed anyone yet. Oh, wait, have you? Uh, no, just knocked out. Unless that one guy I dropped uh, <laughs> yeah, died from it. But I don't think it said anything besides non-lethal. Let's see. Uh, uh, um, yeah. Are those Priuses on the parking lot? They look more like smarts to me. Smarties? Yes. Uh, uh, oh, smart cars. Yeah, that, there's a brand like that, I think. Not. I forgot that was a thing. Okay. 
Okay, log into that. Disconnect that. Actually, reconnect that. And lock him in. And just to mess with him <laughs> in the dark. <laughs> now, next step is Maybe this door he's here. Traumatized, ain't he? <laughs> well, if he's afraid of the dark, then I don't think he'd have much of a career in police. I think it's more like he's gonna be if we come afraid of the dark, thanks to you. Okay, open that up. This is a very secure door. Uh, oh, uh, that was not the... <laughs> that was not planned. Uh, we accidentally crossed him. Oops. I missed that simply by blinking. <laughs> okay, uh, let's just... The even... It splattered all the way over here. <laughs> okay, uh... uh oops. Now you have become spring healed yak. To start practicing your British accent. Okay, open the door, get down. Uh, actually, we can go, we can get there from there. But we don't want to go down the stairs even further because then we'll get shot. Okay then. Let's, let's open this door up again. Out of his cage. I think they can still see you if you get too close. There we go. Back into the blue system. Now let's see. Um, mm -hmm. Okay, we probably should have hacked into the here earlier. But I don't think there'll be a need now that we can do that. I can only connect it to one thing at a time. But I can connect the door to the lights and disconnect the lights. This way, once this thing gets triggered, it'll activate both the door and the light, trapping him in there. Okay. So all we need to do is go down. <coughs> Hmm. And there we go. Let's disconnect everything just to be safe. Let's see. Can another we turn one. that camera off? This is a lot another one in a room. Yeah. Uh, and we can connect this to that. Knock out that guy. And let's see. Connect that to that. This is a, a vault door. Opens when activated, closes three seconds later. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, probably would be best if we knock. Oh, the camera reactivated again. Hmm. Okay. How are we going to open that up then? Hmm. Oh, actually, we can do it by. No. Um. Hmm. Oh, I... Okay, we can act. We can connect this camera to this elevator. Uh, which means that if we get seen by this one, that was that was a bad idea. Okay, camera to there, that to there, and hmm, then we might get stuck in there though. Let's try. Okay, that opens that. Then we connect this button to this door, and this camera to this door. And we run back and forth, and we're in. And now that door to here. Wait. Oh. Now we are stuck. 
because we did act this act and disable this camera. <laughs> Oops. Uh, uh, wait, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> I somehow managed to glitch my way through the freaking door. What? Uh. I think we got our objective. Okay. Open that up. And then we can just leave through the glass window here. Alright, well, I'm gonna take my leave now. It's been fun. See ya. See ya as well, and thanks for watching. Wait, this already been broken? Huh? And straight into the subway. Okay, uh, yeah, that was not a non least one, and we missed another laptop. I need to keep a better eye out for those. Did you find the original bits here, Ari? First from the recycled bin, I suspect we're not dealing with a clever cop. Superb. Oh wow, she was shot three times, not one, and the second two shots were point blank. Rain and clone planet range, seconds after she hit the ground. Whoever killed Selena Delgado, they dropped out of a third story window to make sure she was dead. Yeah. Uh, we're either dealing with a professional operative or more than one shooter. Either way, this suggests Katie Collins is innocent. I think there's a word missing. Whoever killed Selena Delgado, they dropped her out of a third story window to make sure she was dead. Can you release it? Yes, but not yet. I need enough to get every dirty cop in this town arrested the moment I go public with this or I'll disappear under suspicious circumstances. I can handle that side of it, but I'll get in touch if I find any more about her killer. Thanks. Thanks, Conway. Let's see. <laughs> And we're at the two-hour mark. So, yeah, what do you think about this game, huh? It's entertaining. Uh, yeah, I forget the name of the ones who made this, but we can fix that quite easily. Though this... Actually, I moved this here because <laughs> unloading that now is going to screw with my screen resolution and the position of everything. Okay, here we go. Uh, it's game. Not if you go to the save and go to the main menu. Yeah, it, the the game is running at full, you know, in full screen on a lower resolution than my game, than my computer runs. Let's see. What? Gunpoint on Steam. And yes, it's a uh, ten out of ten on Steam. It says. Let's see. Very positive. Overwhelmingly positive. Suspicious Developments is the developer and publisher. It's an indie. And let's... <laughs> the first thing that pops up. Tactical Breach Wizards. Wait, what? <laughs> let's see. Tactical Breach Wizards is a small-scale turn-based strategy game. It's a tactics game where you play a team of wizards in modern-day tactical gear, breaching and clearing room full of armored, ho armed hostiles by making clever use of interesting spells. It's still in early development, so everything about it might change. Okay, ah, uh, ah, uh, yes, Heat Signature. That's also a good game, but uh, it's one of those games that too much of it becomes, uh, yeah, boring. But I might play that as well some other time. Uh, oh, there they have titles on these. Uh, Tactical Breach Wizards. The title is Wizard People Through Windows. And heat signature, be a jerk in space. Yeah, I, I like these guys. Let's see, is there a way to subscribe to these guys to see what games they make? And on gunpoint, the title is Demonstrate Everyone. Demonstrate for the people who may not notice means throwing someone out a window. Okay, there's two other games here that I haven't heard of. But I'll definitely be taking a look at this Tactical Breach Wizards when it comes out. Uh, release date when it's done. That That's how games should be released. When it's done. <laughs> I'm, I'm wishlisting things. Today. I'm wishlisting yeah, that. If it is good when it can say about-ish. 
But when it's done, it's not works too, unless there's something suspicious about it. Yeah, people get annoyed when games get delayed again and again and again. Uh, so yeah, to just say when it's done is good. Yeah, yeah. recently Valheim team have announced the change in their to-do list that it will not, it will take a bit longer for them to finish the game for due to, they have gotten so many players, this means a lot of bug reports. This has revealed to them that there's more work they need to fix before the game is fully released, so it may take a, an extra year. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> uh, I'm looking at the Tactical Breach Wizards uh, yes, win page, and there's a button here Check out the entire Demonstration Trilogy franchise on Steam. <laughs> Which is Gunpoint, Heat Signature, and Tactical Bridge Wizard. <laughs> <sighs> okay, I'm, I'm buying that game. These people have had a good... Uh, these people have had a good uh, record so far. And there's a demo of this game for people who want to, who want to try it for themselves. And maybe try out some other of the <clears throat> other of the yeah, chat options. Why can I not speak? So let me see. Oh, I yes. There's it in chat for everyone. I'll also put it in the description when this goes up on YouTube. Uh, no, not that. Okay. But uh, yeah, this has been finishing up Geometric Sniper. It has me interested, but yeah, I'm not sure if it, I think it was a one man thing or so. So maybe someday we'll get a sequel to that. I am somewhat interested in how it will continue, uh, but I can't really take it quite seriously after just someone with a top hat pops out of nowhere to shoot <laughs> a military sniper or a military operative. Yeah. That sounds a bit too cheesy. Yeah, he even had the freaking curly mustache. But yeah, I was honestly ex expecting that to end with uh, the, the character suiciding by gun. Because, well, that gun was at the table for the entire game. Yeah. But for now, yeah. We'll, we'll continue with this and maybe finish it up next Saturday. But for now, as always, uh, you are away now, Atlas Gaming. But still, thank you very much for uh, for watching and talking, and special thanks to you, Dirk here. Oh, you're most welcome. And yeah, tomorrow, uh, something Sunday, two to four games, and then Tuesdays we'll continue on with Works Must Die Two. Yay! <laughs> but as always, until then, until then. Be safe, folks. Uh, will this work now? No, it will not. Okay. Seriously, why the hell do you refuse?